Hey everyone, I'm back with another video. Today is September 28th, 2017. Um, we have, let's see, Friday, today's Thursday, Friday, Saturday, and Sunday. We have three more days before we start on the liquid diet or whatever diet you're going to do um, as we follow along together. Um, let's see, there's two things I want to talk about today. One is make sure you get enough sleep and enough rest while you're dieting or any time, I guess, actually, the rest of your life, um, because I have tracked it on my scale. I noticed that when I am not getting enough rest and enough sleep, I don't lose as much. Sometimes I don't lose anything. And if I do get enough rest and enough sleep, the pounds just come off. It's amazing. So while you're doing this, especially in this two-week period, make sure you get enough rest and you got to take care of you to make sure that this is successful, okay? So, then the other thing I wanted to talk about is, um, Tuesday night I was able to go to a Major League Baseball game, which was so fun, and the people I went with was so fun, and, were so fun, sorry, um, and, but the seats, okay, I have gained 40 pounds since the last time I was at the, the stadium, the seats were so tight and so uncomfortable, and, I couldn't even sit in a, in a seat next to somebody, even though that person was small, because I was too big. I mean, I was crowding them, and then the 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 arms of the chair were digging into my hips and my thighs, and it just was so uncomfortable. And I spent the whole evening uncomfortable, and I and I feel like I've spent my whole life that way. I've just been uncomfortable. Um, so. The reason I'm telling you this is because those are the, the things that we're going to be able to, you know, not have to worry about. We're not going to have to worry about, am I going to fit in that chair? Am I going to fit in that space or whatever? Um, those are the best things about losing weight. It's going to be so refreshing and so, it's going to be a whole new lifestyle. Um, that's what I experienced before. Um, in 2015, I had the get vertical sleeve gastrectomy. Um, I did great for about a year. I lost 120 pounds, but then because of my own stupidity and stress and whatever, I went back to eating the way I had before the surgery, um, which was my own fault. Um, so I gained 40 pounds. So the main purpose of this liquid diet is to get those 40 pounds off or at least close to it and get a fresh start. I'm going to start, um, exercising and I may take the uh, video on some of my walks and I just I really want to hear back from you guys and if you could comment below tell me what you like about the videos what you don't like I mean I'm open to any suggestions I've heard that if you wear earphones that the sound is better um, I'm outside in my car right now at lunch so I'm hoping that you're not getting a bunch of background noise Okay, so, yeah, the fitting in the chair was not fun. I spent the whole evening worrying about, because I had to move around to different seats that were open, and then I'd be think I was hoping nobody would be coming to claim that seat, because I had to have a seat that wasn't open next to somebody else. Um, so I spent the whole night looking over my shoulder, is somebody coming, is somebody going to want this seat? It wasn't fun. But I mean, the the evening was fun. I had fun with the people I went with. It was it was very fun, but it was just that old feeling of, ugh, I'm this big and I don't fit in that chair and it's not fun. Um, um about ten years ago, I sat for my CPC exam. Um, the chairs that they had were they were not wide enough for me, of course. Um, and I had noticed that during the class. The class was really uncomfortable. Um, you went every week for s six months, I believe, something like that. Anyway, um, I was so uncomfortable during the class that I couldn't hardly concentrate because the uh, arms of the chair were digging into my thighs. Um, so when I knew I had to take the test, which was a five and a half hour long test, I asked the instructor if I could bring my own chair, and she said yes, which was uh, very nice of her. Um, so here I am, the day of the test, rolling in this office chair from my house that didn't have any arms on it, and 
I mean, it was embarrassing and humiliating and it's just ugh. so yeah I make a lot of noises to express myself so anyway I passed the test that was awesome first time I passed the test and um, um, it's just things like that you know that you remember you go you think back on that are like man it's been rough very rough and I'm sure it's who <laughs> Ugh. it's made me who I am today and I'm not um, bitter I'm not you know sarcastic about it I'm just ready to be over it I'm ready to not worry about it anymore the fact that I can still sit in a booth at a restaurant is awesome um, it's the most rewarding feeling it really is you would think that something that small I mean other people in the world take that for granted they just whip right in there sit down and start you know looking at the menu but I always have to look at the at the booth and think, am I going to fit in there? Um, I'll let my friend sit down first, see if that's big enough for her or my family, you know. Um, it's, it's like a constant thing everywhere you go. And I know those of you who are listening to this right now who have been over, let's say over 200 pounds, over 250, over 300, over 350, even higher. I, go, I was up to 375 when I first started this journey. Um, I know that you know what I feel. I know that you know. So we're going to fix this and we're going to um, have a much better life, much more fulfilled life. And you're not going to have anxiety every time you go out thinking what kind of chairs are there going to be or am I going to fit in that or whatever. Um, there were some churches I would go to that had those um, little metal fold-up chairs. Um, yeah, no, I can't. I would break those. So everywhere I would go, like if somebody would invite me to something, I would have to like hint around and sneak for information about like what the seating's going to be like without trying to say, hey, is this chair going to be strong enough for me to sit on? <sighs> so sounds like I'm rambling I'm just trying to make sure that you know that there's other people out there like you and like me and you know only you know how you feel and only I know how I feel don't let anybody tell you well that's stupid you could just get there and find a different chair no sometimes there are other chairs I mean we know this from our experience so that's what I have to say about the game I went to. It was a blast though, it was fun. We took an Uber, we thought he was gonna kill us, but, um, I mean, cause of the way he drove. Um, anyway, that doesn't matter. That doesn't matter at all. Okay, I need to get back to work. I hope that you enjoy this video. Please like and subscribe. Um, today is, I think I already said that, today is September 28th. October 1st, we're going on this diet, so, um, please let me know if you're doing it with me. If you're not, um, just give me some encouragement or the others who are in the group. And I'll see you later. Okay? Have a good day. Bye.